wolves, stuff like that, that would come to try to eat your animals, right? It will get hurt on a barbed wire fence. So this just needs a little bit of lime juice. Which, where did it go? Okay, it's right there. I actually pulled it up already. Quit looking at me like that. So, I don't know, just a little bit. Not much, like a teaspoon. Just to give it some acid. A little bit of acid goes a long way. So, there we go. It's beautiful. See, it's still nice and thick, but it's still like a pliable sauce, I guess you could say. Let's give this a taste. Make sure the seasoning is up to standard. We have to like add anything, take it away. Not really take it away. Totally chose the wrong spoon there. Um, so the guy behind me, he had an ostrich farm. Oh, wicked. Ostrich. Mmm. That's delicious. The salt is there. Yeah. Cumin is there. That's great. That is fan freaking tastic. Ostrich egg omelet, please. Yeah, just like big fucking omelet. I'll have a three uh, ostrich egg omelet, please, anytime now. That would be hilarious. The good old ostrich egg omelet. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. So this is going nice and strong still. And yeah free rides that would be wicked go and do some free rides anyways anyone that's new here um, I asked this to go in there but it never did um, we um, actually everybody everybody please everybody even if you're not new here um, it's uh, we set up this shit I spelled it wrong we set up this. Um, there is the Giant Fork giveaway. It will be signed by Holly and I, and it doesn't say it there, but we will um, We will be throwing in a $25 gift card to Amazon. So, um, yeah. There's five different entries. Everyone, get in there. And, uh, yeah. Please, please, just, Please follow me on Twitch. Kidding. But yeah, really, there's the Giant Ford giveaway with a $25 gift card to Amazon also. Um, up for grabs. Um, there's eight days left, I think, on it. And then we will be, you know, sending it out. Signed by us both. If you really want it. But really, it's more just to get everybody connected on all of the social media platforms, which that would be actually very nice of you all to do if it's possible um, yeah so we threw that in there um, yeah uh, I'm new here why are you new here so I'm back there one day and I hear a weird sound go on an ostrich runs at me at about 30 miles per hour I was startled I would be fucking startled too God, could you imagine? That would scare the shit out of me. Just the absolute crapper out of me. Um, his cheapest chef knife in his online store is $325. Most expensive is $600. Okay. I will definitely go check that out. Because one of these days, I, I could get the $300 knife for sure. Um, yeah. Did he go meep meep? <laughs> Fuck, Manny. Fuck. Did he go meep meep? Maybe he did. Maybe he didn't. Um, okay, so from here, let's um, start soaking some rice. We need to soak one cup of rice for our, um, for our, uh, this thing. Uh, fire. 
Bryani. Bryani rice. Okay? So, for Bryani rice, we need to soak one cup of rice for it. So that's all I'm making today, is just one cup. Not two girls, just one cup. Um, yeah. I look left, I would drop kick that bird. Why would an ostrich go meep meep? 200 ostriches stampeding? God, that would scare the shit out of me. <laughs> Roadrunner isn't an ostrich? Uh, isn't the Roadrunner an ostrich? What is the Roadrunner then? I could have sworn it's an ostrich. Um, yeah, weird. And yes, he will do a custom knife and handle. Oh, wicked. That's fucking sweet. I will definitely go and check this guy out. Because I want to watch him make the knife too. Yeah, he's a... Oh, he's a roadrunner? Isn't he an ostrich though? Or is, is... Oh no, there are actually roadrunners. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, no mac and cheese. No mac and cheese. Every time you bring up mac and cheese, you make me want to make mac and cheese. Maybe Friday? How about this? Cry. We'll do mac and cheese balls. And then we'll deep fry them on Friday. Because Friday's our Friday. So we'll bring out the deep fryer on Friday. And we'll make mac and cheese. And then we'll make balls out of it. And then we'll bread those. And we'll deep fry mac and cheese balls. We'll also do corn dogs. Because I promise that we'll do corn dogs on Friday. And then on Thursday, because we're making cheesecake... We're gonna make a cheesecake, we're gonna freeze the cheesecake, and then we're gonna pull it out of the freezer, and we're gonna bread that, and we're gonna deep fry a cheesecake. Like literally, we're gonna deep fry a whole cheesecake. So, yeah. We're gonna go like hard on, yeah, Roadrunners aren't even big at all. You know, now that I think about it, they are fucking tiny. They're like, they're little guys, they're probably like, you know, Earl would eat one, no problem. Actually, probably not. Earl's fat. He wouldn't be able to catch one. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Um, I'm running in front of an ostrich stampede like a parade leader. <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. <laughs> uh, that is great. Uh, the moussaka turned out okay, but I didn't have enough nutmeg for the bechamel. Ah, shit happens. It's all good. I can't even give. Oh, I can't enter the giveaway because I've apparently already used my email on that site, and I don't know what I use it for. You probably use it for somebody else's giveaway. That's kind of weird, Bubbles. You should be able to, no matter what, because it's like a different person. Um, not sure if I can post the links, but if you'd like to see some of the work, some of what he sells, go to uh, FowlerBlades.com. Um, Bubbles just permitted you also, but like here, I'll just like, I'll put that in the notes also. Because I don't, I don't want to do this like on here in front of all of you guys because I can't show you because my computer's way over there and it just doesn't like look good. You weren't ready. It's all good. Um, but like you'll get permitted again, get ready. You'll get permitted again, so other people in chat can then like take a look at the knives, right? So I'm just gonna put this in the note, also, and then that way, um, I'll have it ready to go. Because unfortunately, you know, I'm in the kitchen, not in front of my computer, and I don't want to do this. Uh, yeah, like I'd walk off screen. There's no camera on me showing stuff. It's like annoying. I, I just don't want to do that, um, unfortunately. But um, are you ready? Because bubbles will permit you and like whenever you want to. Um, how do you catch an ostrich? Probably shoot him in the face. Um, cops, fire department, citizens, the great ostrich roundup. I had to catch my own sheep. Wow, that would suck. Fuck ostrich. Have you ever looked in their eyes? 
<laughs> I can say I've never looked in an ostrich's eyes. That's hilarious, though. That is just freaking hilarious. Let's see if this meat's fork tender yet. Definitely isn't. That's when you know it's done. Like, definitely is not fork tender. Let's just put it that way. Hmm. Interesting. I just tasted it. Ooh, you get the spice afterwards, though. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Wow. There was a lawsuit. I could only imagine. Punitive damages. That ostrich ran me over. Ooh, I got five entries. There you go. Someone got beaked. Oh. 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 We're gonna start getting our rice ready. He's on it, you know? So. I'm gonna chop up all of this, get it ready to go into our Bayerani rice. Damn, this knife needs a sharpening. I need to actually on stream. I'm gonna sharpen my knives one day on stream. I'll get out all my stones and sharpen. And that, I shit you not, when you sharpen knives, that is where you just get, um, you get annihilated on stream. Or you get annihilated sharpening your knives. That's just what I gotta say. Um, you literally, you get a 12 pack of beer, you get a 12 pack of beer, and you just get out your stones, and you just drink beers, and sharpen, and... It takes forever to sharpen knives, by the way. Um, so, um, yeah. By the end of it, you're like, just like, like, yeah. But it's lots of fun. It's Sharpening is like a hassle, and that's why you need to have beer. Um, I know, it doesn't sound too professional. It's like you're sharpening knives and getting incredibly drunk at the same time. And it's like... Yeah, 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 that's that's what you do. Um, it's, uh, it, it's, it's not fun sharpening knives. So to get them nice and sharp, you drink beer while you do it. That's, that's just, uh, it's just what you kind of do, okay? Anyways, so, um, curry's going. Let's check on our nan bread here. See how much this has risen. Because it's all rise, motherfucker. Stop rise, motherfucker. Okay. It's almost doubled in size, actually. It doesn't look like it has, but it has almost doubled in size there. I'm just going to keep it rising. The more you let it rise, the more it will look good. Could have six if I had Facebook. Oh, I almost doesn't have Facebook. Who in their right mind doesn't have Facebook? Um, but you got five entries, so someone got beaked. The gentleman now has a caribou farm. That's even more interesting. I like caribou. Beer, that is. Um, dropped antlers sell well in China. Yeah, they probably use it all for like a whole bunch of like different stuff. Um, uh... Get out your stones. Uh, here. Can I get them out right now? I think I can. Um, my GF uses our garage as her proofing room for baking. Really? Usually, like, is your garage really hot? Like, and steamy? Because that's, uh, it's normally what you want for proofing. Like, steam. A nice steam related. I don't know. Okay. So that is a, okay, here we go. These all have numbers on them. And what you normally do, this one doesn't. Okay, so these are my nah, stones. Um, it's warm, yes. We live in Florida. Okay, there you go, yeah. So that would make more sense. It's also humid also. So yeah, it's like a perfect area to proof stuff. So there you go, yeah. Makes 
total sense to use your garage then with the humidity and how warm it is.